Many of us have at least one person in our lives touched by cancer. But tonight, North Shore Bureau Chief Ashley Rodrigue brings us the story of a doctor using unconventional and admittedly unusual methods to help patients ease the challenges of the disease. It's the little things that matter most in life, the saying goes. A visit to the St. Tammany Cancer Center can be a sobering reminder of that. But when it comes to Dr. Jack Sox, the little things include radical nail polish, standout shoes. Happy pink day. And an unusual perspective to offer people going through one of the most uncertain moments in their lives. Morning. Oh my God. <laughs> Just a, um, silly. Um, and it takes a, I think it takes the focus off of a lot of things in the clinic. It takes the focus off of somebody dealing with this really heavy issue. And I like your opinion on what is causing it. Dr. Sox uses his eccentric personality in a five foot two frame to balance his emotional medical practice. And everything looks good as far as his. Yeah, he's everything stable right now. So. Oncology and the grueling battle to save his patients from cancer. His chemistry and his kidney function and his liver tests were all normal, like lung cancer, breast cancer, colon cancer, lymphomas. It's a dark job, which admittedly weighs on him personally, too. I'll dig around on his chart and I'll get back with you and let you know what I find out. But Dr. Sox has a colorful character to help himself and his patients mentally combat its challenges. Hello, how are you? It ranges from a laid back, no white coat kind of office style to his most notorious and natural role as a physician pirate. You have this terrible disease, you're spending a lot of time preparing treatments and helping them get through the toxicities and side effects of treatments. And the thing they appreciate most is when you sat down and held their hand and told them a story or something, or let them take a picture of you in your costume. I just love him. He's the best doctor there can be. Dr. Sox is unforgettable and unapologetic about it. This is, wasn't purposeful. It just started happening. Um, and uh, and I, I, I mean, I like, I like the image. Um, I like that people think that about me, um, and um, and I do. I mean, I do really try to um, to just do my thing and not worry so much about what somebody might think about it. And I think we should get that referral done before we were to do any more treatment. It's why he's so beloved by patients, their families, and the community as a whole, as evidenced on the walls and shelves of his office. He kind of livelies up the, the area when he comes in. You know, he's non-typical of a, of a chemo doctor. He's been everything they said he was going to be, and maybe more. If you have to go through this, there's no one better than going through it with Dr. Sox. Sox believes the best medicine is laughter, while fun is the recommended treatment for fear. To Dr. Sox, saving lives is and will always be about the little things. Ashley Rodrigue, Eyewitness News. Well, Dr. Sox can be found in quirky attire outside of the office as well. Throughout the year, he attends numerous fundraisers in costume to help raise money for various efforts, including cancer research, mental illness, and children's causes.